Hi, I'm Andrew, and I like to break stuff. Today, I'm going to destroy the world. I have a thrift store globe, and the first step in this is to cut it apart. There's actually a little seam of tape right along the equator. It should make these two halves pretty simple to take apart. So much for being delicate. There we go. Ah, that's it. There's a cardboard piece on the inside. That's why I was having such a hard time with it to keep the two halves aligned. There's a cardboard lip on the inside. I was never going to cut through that. I used a thick piece of reclaimed wood to make the base by using a router and a circle cutting jig. I did this nice and slow in several passes. Then when it was all done, I used an OG bit to give it a nice profile. Now it's time to start working on these. I need to mask off some areas in order to put more paint on it. After masking it off, I used gray paint to cover up most of the black.
Then I tried to dress it up a little bit with some metallic silver to give it a little bit of texture with cheesecloth. This is when things kind of started to fall apart. I wasn't really happy with how this turned out. With the base of the globe in place, now it's time for the special ingredients. Oh yeah! Red 5 standing by. Luke, you turned off your targeting computer. Use the force, Luke. Or maybe a lighter. Just think about how much better this is going to look when I change the effects in the special edition. That's how you take a project that didn't turn out quite how you hoped and turn it into something fun anyway. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.